Hello people, Kevin Thailand here. Uh, we got a lot of running around to do and sort stuff out today. I'm going to take you with me. We're going to uh, MOT the motorbike, uh, this run out. We're going to tax it, insure it. I'll show you, take you where, where to go. And, and we're going to do a bit of costs uh, for this month uh, with everything included that I think you need to know. Um, so, yeah. My gardener's in. He'll trim all the edges. Mow the lawn. Tied it all up. He's, he's trimmed the tree, the bits. It's all in with the uh, the rent. Uh, all the gardens, everything all looked after. So, uh, I don't want to do it this weather. It's too hot. 35, 36, humidity, how I... No, it's hard enough to shine you out and do the motorbike and get, uh, get your tax. <laughs> so, uh, bear with me. It'll be an interesting day. With uh, the cost of living for the month, electrics, water, everything. See you shortly. Uh, we're at uh, Pattaya Thai. Uh, this, little, this road's continuation up. <laughs> from like uh, Second Road, Beach Road, uh, Walking Street and comes along here up, up, up to uh, Sukhumvit Road we are at basically three quarters of the way up at Sui Fua and Sui Fua is more like an alleyway <laughs> but it leads down uh, halfway down on the left there is land transport, uh, car inspection, uh, ro ro MOT basically, car and bike, and it's 60 bar for a motorbike and 100 bar for a car. Uh, a motorbike uh, uh, five years old before it has to have its first road inspection uh, MOT and a car seven years old before it has to have its first road inspection MOT which is 100 bar <coughs> I, I love Thailand I love Thailand uh, so we're all done uh, now we're going to get up and do the uh, sort out the uh, road tax and stuff so so you at Land Transport, but we're going to the main one on Highway 36, uh, which is also where you'll go uh, to do your motorbike uh, and car driving licenses tests and stuff. So we'll see you there. I want to quickly show you how to get to Land Transport. Uh, you, 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 you go along the Sukhumvit Road, and you cross uh, over the bridge where you go to Bangkok on the motorway. So let, let's just quickly show you. Right here, stay to the right for Highway 7, Bangkok. From here we're going to follow it all the way down to Highway 36 where we'll come off. So uh, I'll rejoin us there as we approach Highway 36 and what we'll do, we'll go over to Kev now at TT Currency Exchange and get a quick look at the exchange rates and then come back uh, to me. So here's Kev. Hello people, uh, here are today's exchange rates for the 2nd of September uh, 2016. 
thank you. Well, that's the exchange rates done. Uh, we'll get back over to Kev, uh, see how far we've got down the motorway there. He, uh, he should be getting close. Right, here is Highway 36, Rayong. It's Rayong, Bang Lamung. Uh, you need to take the left, Bang Lamung. Uh, not the right, you don't want to go to Rayong. We're coming up to the most important part now because you won't find land transport. There's no sign. This here on the left is Regent School. This is your landmark, Regent International School Pataya. The, uh, the lane transport is behind it, but there's no sign. No sign in English. There is a sign, a blue sign. It's, obviously, it's in Thai, uh, but I have no idea what it says. Shall we go just past the school? Hey, we go to indicate but we put our window wipers on again as I always do. We turn here. As I say that blue sign uh, I believe is land transport. I really don't know. Uh, I don't I don't I don't do anything so I don't speak so I'll read so I, unfortunately I should. They don't like you knowing Thai uh, in the bars and that because then you know what they're saying about you. So it's always best not to let them know even if you do. You can hear we're getting and find out what they really think of you. But that there, land train, that is the only sign for land transport here. And this on the left, on the right, sorry. This is Lane Transport. This is where you can't. Uh, you can get your tax disc from other agents like the Honda Garage, they'll do it for you. They will charge you, but it, it will take a week or two and then they'll call you, you go and get it. Here, if your tax has run out, you'll get it today. Uh, this is also here where you get your driving license, your motorbike license. And if you need to do the test or on the track for the motorbike license or car, this is also here at the back here. This is the track that they test you on. I'm at Lane Transport uh, to ensure, uh, ensure tax the motorbike, uh, the uh, PCX. I have to come to here first, uh, this is the uh, land transport, the offices at Highway 36. I have to come here uh, to this shop first. Here, it's literally a bang opposite the out entrance. Uh, to renew my insurance. Uh, insurance for the year was 675 bar. I did ask what that was for, like whether it was number one insurance, uh, like the best insurance, number two insurance. She didn't know what I was asking. Uh, uh, <laughs> I gave up in the end, but I'm insured to get my uh, tax for the uh, for the bike. So now we're going into here. 
Uh, it, I won't be able to take you in, uh, but I'll show you the entrance. It's, it's just here, this building. This is the main entrance to the building. Uh, first of all, you're walking on the left, there is an information. Uh, quickly, just here, tell them what you want. They'll give you your ticket number for which booth you want at the back there. Uh, you got uh, one, two, three, four. So they will give you uh, your ticket and, and you just watch your number. Right. Here we are out again. Uh, so that's me tax stamp for me motorbike. If you come here, uh, uh, where is it? You'll get your tax disc uh, for your bike straight away. If you go to the agents in Pattaya, uh, you'll wait two weeks for it. You'll have to go back and pick it up. You'll pay them for uh, services, all sorts. Uh, but you'll still have to wait. My, my uh, tax had ran out uh, the 29th of uh, August. It, it's now the, I don't know what it is, 1st or 2nd of uh, September. I've been fined uh, for late payment uh, for the tax. One bar. <laughs> what? It, it's, it's one bar per month uh, for late payment. Per month, one bar. <laughs> Never mind. And the tax for the year was a hundred bar for the uh, motorbike tax. That's brilliant, eh? <laughs> right, let's get back to Kev. Right, we're, we're back home now. So, just to recap on, on everything expenditure for the motorbike. Um, which is for the year, really. Uh, the insurance was 675 bar. The tax was 100 bar for the year. Uh, road inspection uh, MOT was 60 bar, which is for the year. Uh, the service oil change, gearbox change, uh, uh, gearbox oil, uh, spark plug, whatever filter, uh, was 600 bar. Oh, a one bar fine <laughs> on the uh, on the uh, yearly tax. Uh, that one bar fine is uh, per month up to three months. So uh, y l let's get that right. I think once we're after three months. It might go up to two bar, it might go up to, uh, who knows, 500 bar. Um, it, it, you shouldn't go over that. So each month, one bar. It's not over the days. One month, one bar, up to three months. So the, the total for the motorbike, which is for the year, is 1,435 bar. Or at today's uh, currency exchange rates at £31.35 for the year. Um, petrol is 24 bar per litre, so uh, roughly 50 51 pence a litre. The bike, uh, I, I, I normally put 100, 100 bar in it. Uh, to fill it up is, is 125 bar from empty, really. And that will last over a week, depending on how much I use it. Could could last two weeks. Uh, right now for the nitty gritty, uh, that the house uh, that my monthly outgoing here, uh, the rent thirteen thousand baht a month. Electric for uh, August was nine hundred and forty one baht. A uh, water 240 bar, a Wi Fi uh, uh, TV was 790 bar. 790 bar, that's your own Wi Fi and TV. So the, the total costage in pounds 
at today's uh, exchange rate of, of 45.77 would work out at £327.10 uh, for the month. That, that's everything all in electric, water, high, uh, Wi-Fi, TV and rent for the house. In Thailand uh, here, the houses, there are no monthly rates, uh, costs, uh, like the council rates uh, and stuff. There are no, uh, there's no maintenance fees here. It's all included with the, the rent for 18,000 bar, which includes the swimming pool kept uh, clean. Uh, they've just refurbished it right through. I'm gonna go and get in it in a minute. It's, it's up. And um, also the gardens, and the gardens for the properties, as you saw, the garden was here, mowing the lawns, trimming the hedges, uh, cropping the tree, the, 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 the bits on the palm tree. That's all included, you do not pay any extras. So, that, that's my monthly costs of August um, 2016. Um, it's not a lot, is it, compared to England? Or compared to anywhere in the Western world? So anyway, I hope you like my, uh, my little vlog, uh, it's very informational and if you're going to come here to live, it's things you, you will need to know, especially motorbike, you may buy a car, but you will definitely at one stage uh, buy, buy a motorbike and they're peanuts, peanuts to run, uh, even uh, servicing, Me mechanical if anything goes wrong, uh, peanuts. Uh, best thing you can get about them. I would recommend the PCX, um, the, 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 the smaller motorbikes. They are the main things I see accidents on. Um, the thinner wheels, thinner tyres, it adds up to less uh, stability on the road possibly. Uh, but the PCX is the best bike, that, that as, as, as far as I'm concerned, that you will buy here uh, to get about on. Uh, very comfortable, uh, fatter tyres, fatter wheels, uh, more stability, 1% uh, uh, safer. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, if you like my little vlog, give me a thumbs up, a like, a share. Uh, subscribe, please subscribe. Uh, we're back out the weekend, we're looking about, we're hunting, and we'll bring you a, a, a vlog around town. So that'll be coming probably Sunday or Monday. And until then, thank you very much for watching. Bye bye. I have nothing to say.